1998, I was three years old. So um, I think I was probably sitting in a carriage. That's actually the age that I probably discovered my love for art. I was a kid, I think I only draw with pencil for stupid stuff. Probably playing with Hot Wheels and Legos because I like to steal my brother's toys. I was two years old, so I was probably taking a nap. I was not taking naps. I take the naps now. In 1998, I was selling SolidWorks. I was working with our reseller channel to make sure that our product was getting out there in front of all the customers, making sure that the resellers were able to support and, and train our customers to make sure our customers were successful. Wow, that's the website of SolidWorks. So it looks like a very poorly designed website. Shake out weaker CAD vendors. That sounds so funny. Check out the competition. Go home, no one likes you. The text is all like blue, like with the old hyperlinks and stuff. So like when you click on, oh my God. And Furbies. And the first thing I notice is the Furby. Furby, wow. That is crazy. There's a Furby on it. There's a Furby on it. This is old. Oh my God, they have a advertisement for SolarWorks World 1999, <laughs> which is just fantastic. They had a SolarWorks World back then. <laughs> That's cool. I am looking at a Life Fitness um, elliptical machine, and it is a animation and rendering of it. It's an assembly and it's moving. You have a nice motion study going. And you have the ladies wearing a leotard with leggings underneath. It's the 90s. It happened. It almost looks like the mind, or like, my, uh, what is it called? Mind Super, yeah. It's kind of cool seeing how it started, because it's come so far. Seeing the graphics there compared to what I was just doing an hour ago, was it's completely different. If someone from 98 were to take like a look at SolidWorks today, they would probably have their minds blown. SolidWorks is 98 plus. This is crazy. It looks like this was like rented from like a library because it has like the sticker on it. It feels like I'm holding like an old VHS. Yeah, oh my god, that is so many discs. <laughs> That's insane. So I am opening a snowmobile, it looks like. I'm used to pressing down on the mouse wheel and having that be rotate. All right, I stopped rotating. Now, yep, yep, that's also different. Pan, have to press the pan button. Now thinking back to SolidWorks today, whenever I change a different view, it, it sort of has like a easy animation so you can see the part rotate, but then here it just automatically snaps to the different views. I uh, literally just cut the engine in half. So it's like very click and drag, not just click, select, click, or whatever. It's like you actually have to. Well, I was not expecting that. You know, this was impressive back then. I remember doing demos in 97, trade show demos, and you were lucky if anybody was doing 50 part demos. Now, you know, we started, when we came in onto the scene, we were doing 100, 100 part demos, 150 part demos, 300 part demos was nothing. I thought SolidWorks was just parts and manufacturing when I first started. I didn't know it had these capabilities and this was really cool for me to see. Working in SolidWorks 10 years from now is hopefully going to be like crazy awesome. Like 3D modeling with a hologram on your desk. So it was great to look at SolidWorks 98. It brings back a lot of memories for me and soon SolidWorks 2017 is going to be out. Continually following the theme of listening to our customers adding more new features and capabilities to make them more productive.